Optimize workloads to each provider's strength. So as you're assessing these workloads, sometimes you're going to find that certain workloads will work better on certain cloud providers. Now I would say 95% of the time, all workloads are going to work the same on most of these large hyperscale cloud providers. But in some cases, you will find some requirements that are more available or better available or have been tested better at scale in one cloud provider versus the other. For example, if you're looking for high performance compute, then AWS has been doing spot instances and giving people access to Hadoop clusters and the high performance compute experience on AWS tends to be a little better than the other cloud providers. That's not to say that Azure and Google don't have the same capabilities, but here you would probably want to look at what AWS is able to offer you. If you're looking for hybrid, then Microsoft has taken a really strong position in terms of hybrid and they've adopted that with in their software. So you can look at what they've done with SQL and stretch clusters, what they've done with Windows Server, and a lot of their software is hybrid by default, essentially. So if you happen to be a shop that leverages a lot of Microsoft technology and you're looking for hybrid, hybrid tends to be more Azure friendly. That's not to say that AWS and Google and Oracle and others don't have hybrid capabilities. They all certainly do, but it will depend on, again, your assessment of this. I'm just giving you some highlights here. For example, in the past, for a while there, AWS had better NFS service capabilities than Azure, but Azure had better SMB and SIFS capabilities than AWS. So if your workload needed NFS or SIFS slash SMB, then you would, you would have chosen one versus the other. So the bottom line here is make sure that you're assessing the specific requirements and capabilities that you need so that you're able to better optimize, better align these workloads to the cloud provider that gives that workload the best chance to operate efficiently.